Guys, if you're home watching this, trying to learn how to put your Omni stroller together, this is how easy it is. I literally pull this button lever right here and boom, carriage mode. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Judane. And in today's video, I will be attempting to put together my travel system. I am currently in my last trimester of pregnancy, literally any day now. So I decided to attempt to put this together. I don't have to do this at all. I just want to try to see if I can do it. That way I can learn about this stroller and see how the functions work and play around with it, basically. So... I am out of breath. <laughs> I got this travel system from Walmart. So it is the Even Flow Omni Plus Medulla Travel System. And it can hold up to 50 pounds. And um, it is reversible. It has six modes. Um, as you can see them here, you there's the bassinet mode. Um, they can face, baby can face you or they can face forward. If you don't want to carry along the stroller, you can literally just use the base with the car seat and it can face you or forward. And it's basically just showing you the different options. Once the baby gets a bit older and no longer need bassinet, you can turn it into basically the stroller, which is like this. So those that's what it looks like. I've already taken everything out of the box. Well, I didn't. But I got someone to take it out of the box because, anyways, I did get the stroller and car seat in gray and black. Um, it goes with everything. Um, I'm basically going to be going with the gray theme. I have a gray... Um, diaper bag, a gray crib. I'm into gray this time around so I'm gonna show you what the car seat looks like this is the car seat Omni plus car seat I like the padding inside so yeah that's what it looks like and it comes with a base which I already attached so that's what the base looks like that you connect to the car um, and if they like, this thing is to just click, you click here. It's kind of hard because it's in my lap and I have a belly. So yeah. So you, to release this down or up, you press the two buttons at the side. And I love that this canopy thingy is like big enough to cover baby. We live in Canada where the, you know, it's going to be cold. Um, it's going to be cold soon. So I, I really do love that this can come all the way here. I also got an extra canopy to just cover baby and ensure that baby is warm. So for the most part, it looks doable. And I'm going to see if I can see what, what the weight allowance on this one here. One of my favorite things about this car seat is that it tells you the weight here. So like recline indicator, like it has like a recline indicator. So here it says um, four to 20 pound. You shouldn't pass this blue line and then 20 to 35 pounds. This is the maximum. This is where it goes. As you all know, like when baby gets a little older, they will need a different seat that they, and they will start facing forward instead of rear in the car. So this works perfect for me. Um, yeah. It's the car seat. My boyfriend will connect this to the car. And I'm going to try and put the stroller together. I didn't even tell him I was doing this. He's going to see this video and he's going to be like, you're doing too much. So yeah. Let's take the wheels out. So this is the back wheel. The back wheel is a lot bigger than the front one. This is what the wheel looks like. <clears throat> I 
to the front wheel. The front wheel is a lot smaller. See? Compared to the back. I most likely will not be using my stroller a lot. I will mostly be using the base and the car seat. Um, I don't think I need the stroller. I just need the base and the car seat because we'll mostly be driving. But during the, the summertime, we'll be taking walks and I'll use the stroller more often. So yeah, this is what it looks like. And it can hold up to 50 pounds. a lot because my daughter I think my daughter is 59 pounds and she's eight so this will be able to, to last I hope this is what the, the base or the frame looks like right this is what it looks like to open it there's a little lock there's a lock at the side here you want to pull it up so pull it up gently while you're lifting this section here so basically like that and this is how you unlock the frame. And then it will click. I like that it clicks loudly so you hear that it's open. Ooh, this is the upgraded basket. This one has the upgraded basket. So look, it's like really big. It's huge compared to the older version. Now we have to attach the wheels. I'm gonna turn it upside down so we can attach the wheels. I decided to put this on the actual box that it comes in so you guys can see. Where's the back? So yeah, this is the back part. Attach the wheels. Try to make sure that you don't put it on the wrong way and it shows it will it's gonna click into this thing here um guys i didn't even read so yeah it's gonna click in oh it's, guys it's actually easier than i thought it was going to be wow i feel like bob the builder right now nine months pregnant Bob the Builder, yes we can. <laughs> and then, hopefully I don't put on the wheels backwards. Guys, it's that easy? Oh my gosh, can you tell I didn't even read the instructions? So you just basically push the wheel into here and it clicks. Voila! I'm so impressed. Wow. Wow. Okay. Okay, Jadane. I'm excited. This looks good. Okay, let's move this out the way. And guys, don't worry. It's very lightweight. I'm not lifting. It's, it's not heavy at all. I swear to you. It's not. It's very light. So guys, this is the frame. This is what it looks like. When I put the wheels on, this is the brake. The back wheel is a lot bigger than the front wheel, and this will be perfect, especially during the winter time. Um, I did what I like about this stroller is the fact that the basket is huge. They upgraded the basket um, on this one. Usually, the Omni Plus um, Medulla travel system, the basket is literally half of this but i realized that this one is the upgraded version of it so this is what i was saying if you don't want to attach the cart the full stroller section the carriage if you don't want to attach the carriage um which i will not be doing because i'm just gonna use attach the car seat to here until my baby gets a little older then i'll start using the carriage um so yeah, this is what it looks like. I like the basket. Okay, let's try to 
I'm going to try and put the carriage on and put on the bassinet mode so you guys can see what it looks like. And then I'll click on the car seat so you guys can see what that looks like. This is the other part of the stroller. This can be used for the carriage slash bassinet and then also for the toddler mode. So yeah, I'm going to attempt to click it in. And this can face forward or uh, rear seating if it's based on your... I'm actually surprised at how easy this thing is to assembly. Like a pregnant woman can assemble this thing. Can you believe? Wow, this is sick. I like it. I just don't... How do? You... Maybe I should have read the instruction how to turn it into carriage. <laughs> And it has it doesn't come with a snack tray so this doesn't come with a snack tray for baby but you can order one um separately from even flow or walmart or babies or us and I, I checked the price and i think it's 30 something dollars which i'm gonna get later i don't need to get it now because my baby won't be using the snack tray right now so yeah, this is what the, I really, can you tell I don't know how to use it yet? So this is what the toddler mode, I believe, would look like. I don't know. Um, I'm going to show you guys. Oh, I think you guys can see. Okay, let me show you. So this is the stroller. In toddler mode basically I think it's for you to lower bring this down if you want however you want to go low you want to go and then yeah if you want to fold it up if you want this part to go up like this then you basically hook it in see and it goes up so they can be seated once they're a toddler though. I definitely have to play. Oh, I just discovered how to turn it into the carriage mode. I probably should have read the instruction before doing that. But guys, if you're at home watching this, trying to learn how to put your Omni stroller together, this is how easy it is. I literally pull this button lever right here and boom, carriage mode. I love this. I love this for me. <laughs> mm -mm. This is gonna be me pushing my little baby. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> Guys, the wheels are even locked. I'm so excited. Like, I'm not. I'm... Guys, this is it. This. The wheels, I love that the wheels, like, they they run smoothly on the floor. They turn, guys, they literally turn to 360 degrees, full circle. Like, I don't have a lot of space, but layer. Look, guys, full circle, 350 degrees. Like, sorry, my face is cut off, but yeah, I love this. I love this for me. I'm so excited. Oh my God. What I do like about this stroller as well is that this frame is now upgraded. Before it was like a flimsy, black, skinny, metal frame. But when I checked the old reviews for the old model, people were actually complaining about the wheels. They were complaining about the frames and they were complaining about the basket. So the basket was so small, it was literally half of this size now. And um, the frame was flimsy. And also they were complaining a lot about the, the wheels. The wheels weren't running smoothly. They couldn't turn to a 350 degrees angle. And I think that's why they upgraded. Luckily for me, it's now 2022. It's upgraded. And I love it. I love this. I love this seat. I love this travel system. I love it a lot. I don't know how many times I'm going to say that. 
So yeah, let's show you guys the cup holder, which I think would be mostly for mom. I don't think I'm gonna be using this part. Oh, it just clicks on. Ew. I'm here asking my can. It's so easy that I can literally just figure this out while I go along. And if you wanna go, oh my God. It's this simple, guys. This simple, up or down. And it's literally a lever at the back. It has this little peephole thingy. Let me pull it down so you can see it. It has this little, so you can peek in at baby, like, hey baby, are you okay, boo boo? Yes. If you don't want it to open, you can close it. Uh, to take the carriage off, you wanna press down on these two gray thing right here and lift up. And it's very lightweight, guys. Don't worry, I'm not putting baby in any danger at all. This is lightweight, super simple, super easy. That's what I like about this. To release the actual seat from the base, this is a base that you would put in the car. There's this thing, up, there's a handle right here that you wanna pull. It's kinda awkward because I'm trying to hold it up for you guys to see. And then you lift out. You will leave that part, the base part in the car. So, this is most likely what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make my baby face. So I'm gonna attach, and this thing here is for you to move this up or down. So you just squeeze on it and you can bring it higher, lower, however you want it. And I like that everything clicks so you know it's safe, it's good, right? We're gonna do the, the rear seating so you can see. And I'm assuming that it clicks on the same as the stroller in these little, make sure they're aligned. So yeah, you just click it in like that. And this is your fifth position, fifth or sixth, I can't remember. So yeah, I just clicked in the car seat into the base. And this is your fifth position. So yeah. You only want to push around the car seat and the stroller that's that and don't forget it's the same way you can face it the other way with baby facing you so guys there you have it you've watched me set up my car seat and my stroller and thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next one don't forget to like comment subscribe and hit the post notification bell so when I post, you will be notified. Stay blessed, y'all.